Hi guys, Mike back here at Shakers Dodge Jeep and Ram. Today we're doing another video and doing the video of the all new 2020 Dodge Ram La Mary 1500. We're going to take a quick glimpse of the outside and then we're going to get into all the specifics on the inside in just a minute. And as for anybody that doesn't know right now, we are going through the state lockdown. So for the coronavirus. So but we're still open over here at the Chrysler Dodge Jeep and Ram down at Shakers in Watertown, Connecticut. I'll just take you on a nice little tour of the outside real quick and yeah she does have a Hemi guys she does have a lot of power under that hood so to get into specifics she is sitting on 20 inch polished wheels or rims whichever one you want to uh, name it as uh, they are all season tires falcons uh, which are pretty pretty good tires we have the nice chromed out exhaust tips right here here's your wiring for your trailer right there here's your tow package right here to hook up your trailer the 4x4 badge right there the Lemary badge right here and a nice big badge for that ram Look how gorgeous that that emblem is. And then I'm going to show you the back real quick. It does come with the factory the factory spray and bed liner, which is something that is very very good for the trucks so that way it's not all aluminum and then it gets all scratched up dinged up yeah i mean if you're going to use it for work and everything yeah of course it's going to get all scratched up and everything uh here and there but the spray and bed liner just makes it look a lot more nicer and a lot more it's a lot more durable here's your back lights for uh to see at night time so that way you can see at night time uh, right here is your tie down hook so you can uh, tie down whatever you got going on back here and That's it for the back now She does have a, a fuel tank skid plate electronic locking rear axle It's got nine amplified speakers an 8.4 inch touchscreen tire fill alert rain brake support ready alert braking again it's got a 5.7 liter hemi eight speed automatic uh it does have the 4g lte capabilities show you the inside and just look at lemiri is one of their top elite packages so it's it's done very very nicely here's some more storage space right here which i think is one of like the the best things that ram could have done with their trucks it's very secure uh there's a lot of room back here for all the work crews or your nice big size family uh whichever whichever one you want inside of your truck if you have a work crew that's great it's perfect for the big a big size work crew right there's your usb charging cable so you can charge up those laptops tablets iphones android phones whatever that you guys uh want to charge you got plenty of charging spaces right there uh you have your uh controls back here for the the heat and uh ventilation system and then you got your back window right here which there is a button in the front for the power window so that way I, 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 a lot of trucks have the manual window so that's that's a pretty good thing to have and just look at all the space that ram has done i think ram has done an absolute perfect job with the space that they have made into their ram trucks here's your step up bar right here so all the short people like myself 
And just look at all the craftsmanship that they put into a truck like this. Like, it's absolute gorgeous. A little Mary sign right there. And guys, like, look at that screen. Like, can you guys tell me? Like, yeah, you, you guys probably thought I was in a Tesla, right? Yeah, well, obviously it says Ram, but it, it's all right, guys. I mean, look at that screen. Like, you can't tell me that that's not a beastie, beastie screen. I love it. I love how Ram did that with their trucks. Like, Ram has done a phenomenal job. And you got the Ram emblem right there. Some more cup holders right there. And all the space that you got right here for the center council. Again, I'm a big fan of center councils, if, if you guys didn't already know. Uh, there's some more space right there for the glove box. And then we're going to go check out the other side. And here's the passenger power side. It has an eight-way uh, power, power for the passenger seat and the driver's seat. And it is 4x4. Four four. You can also get it in a couple different... This this model right here comes in a couple different uh, trim levels. So you don't have to get the most expensive trim level. Right here. There's some more storage space right here on the other side. Which is a very, very good thing. I'm telling you, Ram has done a phenomenal job like with their trucks. Like I'm telling you right now. A, a, a great great job now we're gonna go check on the inside and then there's some more of the eight power way driver side seat it's got the power doors power locks power everything here's your controls for your light switches and your headlights and your and all your parking lights and everything. Here's the buttons right here to power your side mirrors and your passenger and your driver side mirrors. Again, look at the craftsmanship that they put into all these speakers and just the craftsmanship all together, the stitching and just everything that they did with this truck is just absolutely amazing. Here's your memory seats right here. So for those of you that don't know about the memory seats, the memory seats are the right here you would push this button right here say if you're in the driver's side and you would push that and you would set it to any way that you want your seat to uh be as like so if you like to sit really far up uh you would just play with all your buttons right here on the side of the seat and until you got to the right to the right setting and you would just hold that button down right there that that one button if you're in the driver's side and that way it would remember the next day when you come in there until you want to change it uh, another time so if you're not comfortable sitting all the way up you could change it the next day or whenever you come back and sit in the driver's side you can change it back to uh going a little bit down or however way that you like it so i mean it, it it, it's very very useful because you don't ever have to like i in my truck i i literally have had it on the same setting since i bought my truck and every day when i get in my car and turn it on it goes right back to the same setting that i had it on there since the first day that i set it to what i set it as so it is a very very good thing to have inside of a truck suv or car they make it in all vehicles so if you ever see that in a car, it's definitely a good thing to have. Uh, here's all your button controls for on your steering wheel. Um, your Bluetooth capabilities right here and your hands-free for your Bluetooth. Um, it is push to start. You hear that Hemi? She sounds very, very beasty. It's very quiet also. Like it, it's pretty crazy because it's a Hemi. So like Hemis are supposed to be really loud. I mean, uh, we'll, we'll get to that in a minute. Uh, I'll show you guys the Hemi and everything like that. And, uh, yeah, so right here is your, is your shifter. So I know a lot of people probably like, what? That's a shifter. <laughs> yeah, this is a shifter, guys. Uh, there's your parking, your reverse, your neutral, and your drive. And here's your 
four wheel drive button right here four wheel drive high four wheel drive low two wheel drive right here which you would keep it in if it's not snowing obviously and then obviously if it's going to snow you want to put it in the four wheel drive um and then yeah you just twist it and then that's how you would get into the drive that you want to the, the mode that you want to go in uh so it's in reverse right now i'm showing you right now the backup camera and everything which like look at look at the just look at the craftsmanship inside of this like it's absolutely insane when i first saw this i was like wow like it, it blew my mind like i i literally was thinking sideways i was like why do i have the truck that i have right now like i wish i had the money to get this truck like it's it's insane uh but yeah uh, it has the heated seats, heated driver's side, heated passenger, uh, the vented seats. So on a hot day, it will vent all of the hotness like coming out of the seat. So it'll be cool on you. So that way you don't have ever have to worry about sticking to your seat when it's really hot out. Obviously, we would just put it in AC anyway, and we wouldn't have to deal with that. But uh, yeah, so here's uh, the mirror dimming right here. And for the mirror dimming, uh the mirror dimming is right up here uh so what that does is when you have somebody with high beams on when you're dri when someone's driving behind you that will actually uh put the lighting to less so that way it doesn't reflect in your eyes and blind you like a lot of people drive with their high beams on and it drives people crazy it drives me crazy so but uh yeah so and then back to park uh we're gonna show you the inside of the touch screen like just look how insane this is guys uh here's your parking uh i'm mean, not your parking sorry guys uh that is your traction control your tow haul uh here's your um trailing trailering controls your parking sensors your front parking sensors now the parking sensors are a very good thing to have so that way like if you put it in reverse and you can't you don't see something say like you're not paying attention to the backup camera or anything it will stop you from hitting something well it'll alert you from hitting something and hopefully you don't hit something because normally when you hear that alert it it will it'll make you think right away like oh i'm about to hit something you know what i mean so yeah so you don't ever have to worry about that uh that's definitely a good thing to have um and the center council thing guys uh for you guys that don't know i'm in love with center councils like i love center councils and ram has done an absolute insane job with their center councils like look how much space is in here guys like you could fit so much stuff in here like i, I can't even like when i first seen this i was like wow like jesus <laughs> it's so it's so big and here's some more space right here you press this button down and then you can push it back or go forward here's some uh cup holders which a lot of trucks it in cars and suvs makes me really mad uh why a lot of these truck or uh, car companies make their cup holders triple the size so when you put your coffee in there and you're driving around it, it goes back and forth and back and forth and spills and yeah it's just it, i hate it but Ram did an absolute perfect job when they made their cup holders. Another thing that I have a big, um, a big thing over, like it, it drives me crazy uh, when I see stuff like that. The way they made my truck, my cup holders were like tr triple the size of this. So it's like when I'm going over hills or whatever or bumps, my coffee swaying back and forth. With this right here, Ram has done an absolute crazy good job because right here, those are perfect cup holders perfect and here's some more a lot more space guys like like it's insane guys uh there's your some more charging capabilities right there you can charge your iphone your android uh whatever that you need to charge your tablet whatever you got all of that right there um it does have navigation just look at this screen guys like it's absolutely nuts like it, it, it makes you think that you're in like in a Tesla or something like and this is a Ram guys. This is a Ram um, I'm pretty sure that they're making these like almost standard in all of their trucks now I'm not really positive. Don't don't quote me on that, but I think that that's what they're doing um, There's the backup camera right here uh, Like I already showed you guys you can put it in zoom and uh, when you're 
backing up for the trailer and putting your trailer in and everything like that uh the camera setting is absolutely perfect for it um it does have the sirius xm just look how nuts that is guys like look at that screen like it it, it bugs me every single time like i love this screen and here's the thing uh, for all your apps and everything. You got the heated steering wheel, heated passenger side, heated uh, driver side, has the Wi-Fi hotspot. So if you don't have um, any service on your phone and uh, you need service, right there, you could just press that little button, hook it up to your phone, your tablet, your laptop, or whatever, whatever Bluetooth capabilities that uh, any of your stuff has. Uh, you just hook it up right here and then it'll give you service like it like ram did an absolute perfect perfect job with this truck guys um there's some more space right here there's another charging capabilities right here it has the universal garage remote right here so that way if, for those of you guys that have uh the garage door openers um it's built into the visor which is a pretty cool thing um you won't ever lose it you can't ever be like oh well my my thing uh i lost my uh garage door opener nope it's built in so you you won't ever lose it guys uh here's the button as like i told you earlier for the back window i'll show you guys see the back window right there opens closes and another good feature that ram has done uh i think that's pretty great um right here is uh to let your uh, back uh, trunk down, um, not your trunk, uh, your back tailgate, sorry guys, uh, your back tailgate, you press that button, it goes down uh, very gently, um, and I think that's a pretty cool feature as well. It also has the SOS and assist, so if you ever get into an accident or anything like that, it will automatically send your location to um, your exact location, because some people that get into accidents can't do nothing or they're scared or they're really hurt and it'll automatically send uh your location to the firefighters uh police officers ambulance all that great stuff so you don't ever have to worry about any of that uh this truck has all of that and here's uh, a spot for those gucci stunner shades you know i always say uh or your regular shades whatever you prefer uh but yeah guys uh this truck literally has absolutely everything that any guy or girl uh, could ever want or ever need. Um, it it literally is one of the best trucks that I have ever, ever done a review on. And it drives like a dream. Um, again, we're down here at Shakers Dodge Jeep and Ram down here in Watertown, Connecticut. Again, um... Thank you for watching my videos. Thank you for subscribing. Uh, I really appreciate all of uh, the people that subscribe and all the people that watch my videos. Again, we're doing a March 27th iPhone 11 Pro Max giveaway. All you got to do is like and subscribe down below, guys. Like and subscribe. Like and subscribe. Like and subscribe. Oh, my goodness, guys. <laughs> Sorry, guys. It's been a very, very long day, and I'm pretty bugged out, as you guys could probably already see. Uh, but yeah, all you got to do is like, comment, share down below, like, and subscribe. And one lucky winner is going to win that iPhone 11 Pro Max, guys. So uh, yeah, just stay tuned, and uh, I'll announce the winner pretty soon. All right, guys, thanks for watching. And here is the 1500 Hemi 5.7 liter badge. There's another Ram badge right there. Here are your parking sensors right here. As I mentioned before, that nice Ram grill right there with the Ram emblem. Here's your tow hooks right here, which are pretty beastie. And then I'm gonna show you guys that nice 5.7 liter Hemi. Look at that, guys. Look at that. Look at that beastie, boy. Look at that big, big, big boy, guys. I'm telling you, with every year that comes out, Ram is just doing a, a phenomenal job. I'm telling you, when you guys test drive one of these, and if you guys ever buy one, I'm telling you right now, it's one of the best trucks that you'll ever own, guys. And another quick view of the outside right here. The step up bar right there for the short people like myself. 
And yeah, thanks for watching, guys. And here is the RAM key fob right here. You hit this button twice, and then the back tailgate will go down very nice and gently. It does have the spray in bed liner factory from the factory. Um, again, she does have a remote start too, which is a pretty cool feature. You hit this button twice right here on a nice cold wintery night. And you hear that guys, you hear how, how beautiful that sounds. This truck is one absolutely amazing, amazing machine guys. Absolutely amazing. And then you just hit the button twice like I just did and then it goes back off So if you live in somewhere like New England like myself um, It's definitely a very very good feature to have whether you buy a car SUV or truck and It's just overall 100% one of the best features to ever have in any kind of car truck or SUV because like I said, I live in New England, so on those cold wintery nights or cold wintery mornings when you have to go to work or when you have to go anywhere for that matter, it's something that is just very, very useful because when you get ready and you go outside, you get to go in your car and it's already nice and warm. It's all good to go. I mean, in cars and trucks and SUVs that don't have it, you have to go out and physically start your car which really sucks, especially if you live in somewhere like New England when it gets really, really cold and it's like negative five out. It's just a really good feature to have, guys.